Hello everyone, I would like to present you a study about influence of the body position on skin blood mucosirculation measured by variable laser Doppler sensors. Cardiovascular diseases are the leading cause of death in the world. Early diagnosis of such diseases is difficult because there are no clinically applied methods for assessing the mucosirculatory bed state. It is known that the contribution of regulatory mechanisms to the mucosirculation system depends on gender, age, measurement area, diseases, and volunteers' body position. In scientific publication, the method of laser doppler flowmetry, based on the evaluation of back reflected radiation by red blood cells, is used for the non invasive determination of the state of mucosirculation. This work aimed to study the reaction of microcirculation to the change in the body position using variable laser Doppler analysis. The cohort of our study included 10 healthy male volunteers, two variable LDF monitors with channels for measuring skin diffusion, temperature and movement were used. The variable devices were located on the outside of right and left wrists. The measurements were carried out in three bodies positions, supine, upright and tilted. The index of microcirculation was measured for 10 minutes in each position of the body and the weight analysis was performed for each signal recorded. When moving from the supine position toward the studies, the measurement area is below the height level, the average skin perfusion and amplitudes of pulse and tone form mechanism decreases. It can indicate a decrease in the flow of arterial blood to the capillaries and the activity of metabolic processes occurring at the wrist area. When change the position from orthostasis to the tilted position, the measurement error is above the height level. The skin perfusion and amplitude of cardiac and myogenic oscillations significantly increases, which may indicate an increase in blood flow to the capillaries and a decrease in the vital tone of the most muscle cells of microvessels. In this study, change in the skin perfusion and regulatory processes were evaluated when the volunteers' body position changed. The position of body is one of the factors influencing the work of microcirculatory bed and metabolic processes. The obtained result will be useful in the development of daily monitoring of microcirculation protocols and also facilitates the possibility of integrating the LDF channel into variable gadgets for assessing the state of human health and early diagnosis of disorders of cardiovascular system. Thank you for your attention.